Wise Co-Pistons booth, and it is their 70th anniversary. And I'm going to talk to Brian a little bit about three different lines that he's been telling me about. Brian, tell me about these lines. Um, Weisco, we've had to uh, you know, develop three different lines because we've got different markets, but we do the Weisco domestic line, which is high-end racing. It's also our late model EFI line, like you know, Chevrolet LS, Ford Modular, and uh, late model Hemi. Uh, sport Compact line, we get into like you know the Subarus, Mitsubishis, Nissans, Toyotas, all of those. Uh, and then the Pro True line is our, it's basically taking our, our parts, you know, but it's more of our bread and butter type of things for the value price type of racer. What else can you tell me about the Pro True Pistons? Uh, the Pro True uh, line is it's basically, you know, made in America forgings, you know, full floating wrist pins, very nice ring pack. Uh, new for this year is the skirt coatings that we put on them, you know, and, and uh, it's kind of different. Like a lot of people, they just develop a part number and uh, just kind of stays stale. But with us, it's just, you know, continuous improvement on all of our parts. Uh, so, you know, late model Chevy, uh, we developed our first LS uh, part number here for the Pro True line. Uh, the first late model Hemi for the Pro True line, you know, was new this year and we found ways to do it inexpensively yet get very good parts. And then from there, uh, you know, we've also got some of the old school stuff, you know, the AMCs and the Buicks and the Pontiacs and all that and very high quality parts. That's awesome. And I saw that on your booth you guys have this brand new 5 liter Mustang engine. Tell me about that. Yeah, very proud of it. Uh, it's one of the, the biggest things that's going to be, you know, not just big this year, but it's going to be big for the next 10 years. Uh, the Chevrolet LS finally has a super big competitor. The 5 liter uh, Mustang engine makes 412 horsepower from the factory. They've got 440 horsepower versions from the factory. And we're just going to go ahead and double and triple and quadruple that. So uh, very excited about the development. What steps did you take to develop the new 5 liter? Uh, well, that was kind of a pretty big investment on our part. It was very hard to find the, uh, the car initially. It's like, well, do we either buy the car or find an engine? So we were able to find an engine after a couple months of looking. From there, we just immediately tore the thing down. Uh, and it's been a neat project. Uh, we have some development partners that we work with. And uh, the first thing was to you know, pull it apart, see what we could do with it. And we pulled it apart, and it looks really good inside, you know, even to begin with, with lots of potential. So we worked with K1, uh, and they've helped us develop a uh, crankshaft and connecting rod for it. Uh, sent the block to ERL, and those guys do some awesome block sleeving on LS and mod motor, and you, know, you name it, they do it. Uh, but we've put uh, all three companies together and we've created the first 351 cubic inch 5 liter on the market. So it you know, kind of takes us back to the original days in the you know, 60s and 70s when that was the number to have. Big developments here at the Wiseco booth for their 70th anniversary. Make sure you check out their website at wiseco.com.